Parents' worst nightmare, their infant or toddler falling into a pool just at the moment when their backs are turned. Well, there's a group in middle Georgia that's teaching small children as young as eight months how to instinctively save themselves if no one's there to rescue them. Check it out. This is one-year-old Charlie Grace's favorite pastime, floating peacefully on the water. Okay, maybe not her favorite pastime, but she's taken to the water like a fish. Like any good mom, hers cheers her on on the sidelines, knowing one day she'll thank her. Well, we have a pool, and she has five big brothers, so uh, we just wanted to make sure if the door was left open or, you know, we turned our back for a minute, if she did fall in the pool, that she'd be able to float. Middle Georgia Little Swimmers is a group that meets in Warner Robins and teaches babies and toddlers how to hold their own on the water a skill that the company's owner says is too important to take lightly. What we're preparing the children for is that event where they fall into the pool and there perhaps is somebody with their back turned. That happened to three-year-old Bryson. Luckily, he knew what to do. He had been taking these swim lessons since he was an infant and before we could get to him, just that fast, he flipped over on his back and floated and self-rescued. Kids like Bryson and Garen are proof the program works. Charlie Grace is still in the beginning stages, but she's getting better by the day. The first lessons are, are quite different. When she started out initially, she would be completely supported. When you learn as an infant, it becomes very natural. It kind of like walking. We don't remember how to walk, how we learned how to walk. We did, but we don't remember that. So you never remember anything but that you could swim. The children have a fun way of learning about water safety. Bryson introduced him to me. See? Who's that? Josh the otter. Meet Josh the baby otter. He swims. Yeah. He swims with the children. There's a special book about Josh and how he learned to swim with his otter friends. I was so impressed with what these kids knew about swimming, especially since I learned to swim much later in my childhood. But they were a little bit more impressed with my microphone than anything else. Why, why do you have that? This is called a microphone. Why? Because it picks up your voice. Like it, and she. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get the mic? I guess it doesn't take too much to please these little ones. And even though Charlie Grace is none too pleased about being in the water today, what she's learning here could save her life. The main thing is whether she likes it or not, it's safe. It's about safety. And that's all that matters. Some cute kids there. And May just happens to be National Water Safety Month. Middle Georgia Little Swimmers meets at the Quality Inn and Suites off Watson Boulevard. For times and lesson rates, I've posted a link to their site on our site. Just go to 41NBC.com.